guys, good to be good morning, ladies and gentlemen. It's just a little over nine in the morning. Oh, we are already up with coffee in a hand. <sighs> what a time! Good times. No, that's a lie. Why I lie so early in the morning? I don't know. Good morning. All right, ladies and gentlemen. The genuine idea is to get fixed. By the way, kinda cool outside. The idea is to go to Johnson's Control in San Antonio and give them a few copies of my stuff. Maybe walk in, kick in the door, and say hello. What are the problems? Right, is here to solve them. Maybe I'll not do that. That's not a wise idea to do in the first thing, the first day. Supposedly the first day, if they're others. Because if they're not, it's just a day, isn't it? Eh? Hey, something to think about. How about uh, some uh, some Shakespeare? Right, number 52, again in Bulgarian, but if you wanna follow along, find it in English. Tai kakto bukatašat samo riadko, parite si broj razbrao dobre, če može udovoljstvo to svatko, u često potreba da zamre. I kakto riadko v mkva kalendarja, sreddevnici prazničnija den, i riadko v kolijetu se povtarja, briljantat v zlatna ramčica v gnezden. Da je točno moj prijatelj od skrina, na vreme to te rjatko te vidja as, podobno skupa treha od koprina, držana za tržestvenija čas. Srce to s radost, vjerfa im je jednakva, se srešta s teb i srešta to očakva. So, uh, uh, got my stuff, my regiments and things and I am going out. By the way, the really odd thing is that I just send it a few emails for a few movie productions and I was thinking that if something actually comes out from uh, from these going to different companies and uh, the productions come back to me I am gonna have an insane catharsis and I'll be torn apart what should I do? I know that the right thing is gonna be if a company comes back to me that I should go with the company because that's gonna be better in a long run, right? Right? But I'm so obsessed with things and creating and doing and... I don't know. It's just the weird things happening in here. Alright, I have no idea where am I exactly. There are people in camo walking everywhere. They checked my ID and I had to go through a little like a... Like a... Like, like a post. I don't know where am I, and I don't think I'm supposed to be here, but it, the, my map says Johnson's Controls is somewhere over here. In 200 feet to left. Oh, it's not there! Oh, that answered the questions. That, that's where I was, apparently. That is the fenced gated community of US Army. I'm out of there. Metroplex control systems. Have to check that out. Alright, Tormax automatic. I have to see what that is too. Gotta see these guys too. Ah, that's what I was looking for. But two things. I arrive, and the moment I park, the alarm into the the facility goes off. I, I, it wasn't before because of me, it was something and uh, the security lady comes over to me and asks me what the hell am I doing here and I explained that I want to uh, give my documents for a job or something and she tells me that they do not do walk-ins, I have to go through a third person company uh -huh. and she asked me very politely to leave immediately yeah, that's that. And I'm running low on my battery on the on the phone over here. And I really hope that I can get to uh, Interstate 10 before my battery dies. Cause... Oh, I'm 
problems, you did it again. All right, I saw the the Star Trek. I just saw the Star Trek from last year. Was it last year? I think it was last summer. Great, I loved it. I liked it. I loved it. Did I? The the scene where the the, the the ship was falling apart and they were running to go and save the core. Why did they shot in that humongous warehouse with those huge tanks? That didn't make much sense to be on a spare starship. But on the other hand, the last few scenes made me think about something. Humans love exploration. Exploring new land and finding new things. Even nowadays we do it. We move from a country to a country to live there and meet other people and travel. They're just tra people that love to travel. But we pretty much have explored every single thing on that planet. And as soon as possible we develop good engines that can tr get us through space I tell you there are gonna be missions like that there are gonna be ships traveling through the nearby galaxies just for the heck of it go see what's there and come back tell us maybe or send a letter it's great it's great when you look up into the stars and you know that, that, that that's not a limit it's not a limit it's you know what's that I don't know, because it's not a limit. Ah, uh, space, stars, galaxies. <sighs> Good night.